Houston County, Georgia. Two officers have just ticketed a pair of speeders on this busy stretch of highway. As they walk up to send the second violator on her way, Corporal Joe Sendek becomes aware of another reckless driver in a very personal way. Officer Sendek is far from all right. The vehicle swerved into the emergency lane and the passenger side mirror struck his left thigh at 60 miles an hour. My leg was bruised from my hip down to my knee. It had done some damages to my back, torn some muscle in my back, and of course it destroyed my weapon. For the moment, Sendek doesn't feel any pain. He just feels his blood boiling as he jumps back in his cruiser and charges after the yellow car that hit him. All I know is that the vehicle ran over my leg and continued to drive on, didn't stop. Motorists move aside as the officer roars past them, searching the traffic for the guilty party. Within a minute, he spots the yellow car casually cruising in the right lane. Adding insult to injury, the driver seems to be ignoring the patrol car's flashing lights and siren that mean just one thing, pull over now. At last, the driver gets the message. Corporal Sendek is finally about to confront the punk who hit him face to face. But the officer is in for a surprise. I asked the driver to step out, and I immediately seen an old man that appeared to be in his 80s. The male acted like he didn't understand or comprehend what was going on. The man's equally ancient wife is only slightly more clued in. As the elderly man retrieves his license, Officer Sendek limps back to his cruiser to take a seat. When a second officer shows up, the woman explains how she was convinced Corporal Sendek had randomly chosen to shoot at them as they passed him on the freeway. The baffled officer isn't quite sure what to say to that. Meanwhile, if Sendek thought getting hit hurt, getting information out of this clueless couple is twice as painful. Don't you need to see your insurance card, sir? What? Insurance card. Insurance card for the vehicle. Even after the couple receive a ticket for leaving the scene of an accident, the woman tries to plead her case again. I thought it was a gun. You thought it was a gun? No, man, that was your mirror coming up the side of your vehicle. The officer has his own theory about why the geriatric gentleman hit him. Obviously, he shouldn't have been driving. <laughs> after months of recuperating while on desk duty, Corporal Joe Sendek is back on his beat but he realized he'd learned a valuable lesson that near tragic day. Since the accident, I've been a little bit more cautious, but again, when you stop vehicles on the interstate, you never know what you're gonna stop or who you're gonna meet or who you're gonna make contact with. Or who's going to make contact with you. <laughs>